Now, we'll come to the next question. This will be further more interesting. It is based on your successive increase. What is successive increase? If you keep on increase by certain rate in every year or based on the any timeline or any variable. If price of paneer increase by 15%, 22% and 34% during last three months, it is big headache. Revolution will start again government. Everything is going, going on the fire or everything uh, increasing the price, it will not affect. But food item increased means it will start to go against the polit it will it will take a political movement price of paneer increase by 15% 22% and 34% in last 3 months find the net increase what we are doing here increase means 1.15 next it is increase 1.22 next increase 1.34 successive increase or consecutive increase one thing always we have to careful like 100 it changed by 15% then it has become 115 now whatever change will happen that base will change means next 22 percent will not change with the base of 100 it will change with the base of 115 due to base will keep on change then here we have to put 22 percent increase it is 22 percent then whatever you will get x again 34 percent then you will get y you can't calculate like 100 it is 115 again 100 22 percent and again 100 34 percent this is not this is wrong what is happening whatever your change has happened the next change will be measured based on the base of the changed value means first base will be 100 second base will be 115 and third base will become x due to directly we can multiply 1 into 1.1.15 1 1.12 to 1.34 then here we can just draw some logical conclusion like uh, this is just now it is converted into multiplication now it is easy. Now it is easy. If you want to just calculate easy, it is much easy. All three numbers you can apply the one of the technique that is multiplication Vedic math technique. If numbers are closer to the same base, what we are doing? Just we are adding the deviation, nothing else. This is 22. This is 15. This is 34. All are base. Base is 100. Deviation is this one. Then what we will do? Just 115 you add with 22. It will become 137. Just to take multiply 22 into 15. 22 into 15 will become 330 into 1.34. Now next we'll continue this calculation. Another one step, just explain explanation purpose. It is taking two three step. If you know you have gone through this technique through in Vedic math, then you will take hardly one one or two second. 137 into three it will become 1.4 and it will become 1.34. Just you add 1.4 and 1.37, 40 and 30, 34 it will become 1.74. Little extra 4 into 3 it will be how much? It will be 12. 12 we have to add means it will be 1.77 approximately 1.77 or 1.78 whatever 77 or 78. Then what is the net change? Net change has become 100 earlier it was there paneer value rate of paneer after three years just suppose it was 2017 then 2020 it has become it has become 1.78. What is the change? Change is 78 percent. Means in three years, 78 percent.